This is the Church of St. Paul in the Desert. Hunter? No. Nathan, okay. Come on. Hi, Sophie. Now, can you kids practice something with me? Okay, watch what I do, and then you're going to do it just like me. Now, let's make it easy. Take your right hand, and I, where I'm going to say, in the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, Amen. Can you do that with me? In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, Amen. That's how I begin, that's one of the ways that people begin sermons, by just praying that God would help us. Some of us need more help than others. So welcome to all of you. And what is the day that we're celebrating today? Easter. Easter. And before I ask you why you're here, what is what happened on Easter that we remember? Easter eggs, yes. What else besides Easter eggs? I've got Jesus. That's Christmas. Okay. <laughs> Jesus died. That's Good Friday. We're we're getting through the whole history of the church. Easter bunny, put the eggs down that we're almost there. Mario. Alleluia, Jesus has risen from the dead. So next, the next one, okay, okay. Um, and so we're here celebrating that, and you heard me reading a story about it, right? And it was about the woman who went to the tomb, and she found the tomb was empty. Yeah, and it made her sad, because she was going to take care of Jesus' body and she got there and she found that it was gone. So do you know what she did? She ran back and told some other disciples, Peter and John, she said, Jesus is gone. I don't know where he is. And so did you notice they ran? They raced each other back to the tomb. Can you imagine anything more competitive than that? They're going to find Jesus and they got a race on the way. But when they got there, they didn't see Jesus. They saw that he was gone, that the wrappings that were on him were gone, and they believed. But Mary stuck around and she saw angels. And the angels were all dressed in white, kind of like Mario and Rodamon, and, and I'm in white today. Um, she saw them, and they told her that she shouldn't be worried about Jesus. And the next thing you know, Jesus is there. And Jesus tells her that it's going to be okay. He's going to be going to God, and they're going to be okay. And he tells her to take the message back to his brothers and sisters. So Mary went back to everybody else and she said, I have seen the Lord. Can you repeat that after me? I have seen the Lord. Okay, so now what I'm going to do is the message of Easter is pretty simple. Jesus is raised. We said, Alleluia, Christ is risen. But everybody here, including those that aren't sitting down in front with me, everybody here has a job. And it's to take the message of Easter back and give it to somebody else. So I need somebody who can read and is a fast runner. You can't read very well yet. Okay. Um, can, you, can you read, Nathan? Can, it's really, okay, Nathan, would you stand up? Nathan, I'd like you to run back. Wait, wait a second. Run back to Mr. Shepherd back there. He's got a microphone and open the message and read the message to him and to us. But you gotta, gotta run. 
run. <laughs> Listen. Christ is alive. Christ is alive. Can you say that? Christ is Christ alive. Christ is alive. Now run back. Yeah. When you tire out, we'll get somebody else. He said, now, I'd like someone else. Uh, I, Mario, would you take that and run over to John Hampson at the speaker? And I did it wrong. I did the wrong order. Go ahead. Yeah, it's okay. Every, other people can run too if you want. <laughs> you can go ahead and run with him too, yeah. Run over to my John and open the message and read it. Check it out with John before you put the mic on. Yeah. God's love wins. Can you say that with me? Win. God's love wins. All right, run back. Yeah, yeah, don't you don't want to trip and fall on the envelope. Come on. All right, now I need one more person. And I need someone who can read well. You you can have that. That's yours. Ramon. And you're going to run to the microphone in the second row right over here. It's a very short run. Right there, he's going to hold the microphone. Okay, so you're going to have to, here's your message. And practice it with him once before you turn the mic on, okay? Yes. You can unfold it. Jesus invites you to share a meal with him today. Jesus invites you to share a meal with him today. Can you say that with me? Jesus invites you to share a meal with him today. So those are the, you can run back now. Just because it's a short distance, don't, don't dog it, okay? Um, you can have it. That's yours to keep. It's, don't say I didn't give you anything. Um, <laughs> So there's three messages for Easter. Christ is alive. God's love, God's love wins. Jesus invites you to share a meal with him today. All right. Now you can go on back to your rows and thank you very much. Can I get a kiss? Love you, sweetheart. Bye, Sophie. Hey, Beatrice. Right over here.